Hi there again, it's uh, hi there. It's Rajiv from RajivKista.com. Today I will show you how to install Google Analytics on a WordPress uh, blog or on a WordPress site. For those who don't know about Google Analytics, whenever you want to measure how many visitors you have on your sites, um, how many daily visitors, monthly, however you want to view it, um, you can use Google Analytics. I'll just Google that for you. Google Analytics is a free tool that you can use. Uh, you just need to have a Gmail account for that. Google Analytics. Let me just show you mine, for example. So I use this domain name, Rich Rajiv Kistu, to show you how to install this blog, how to um, create the post and how to create the pages and stuff. And I'll also show you how to um, install uh, widgets and plugins and how to change the theme. For example, this theme is not really great, but I just used it as an example. Uh, I used the very, very simplest theme that you could have. So uh, for the moment, um, let's go back to Google Analytics. So yeah, you can see Google Analytics account here. I will log in and I will add this domain. just a second before it goes in so I was already logged in there so I didn't really go to the dashboard but you just need to enter your name and uh, email address I mean your email address and your password to get in right so here I've got various profile what I do is I need to add a new website so what I do for that is go on add um, profile and then I add rich rajivkistu.com and click on finish so what I'll have here uh, Google will give me a code this one you usually don't tick it if you don't you're not using Google AdWords yeah so this is the code that um, I should be putting on my site so how do we do this if you have a HTML website, that's a different story. But uh, on WordPress, how does it work? So one second. Rich, rich, richrichrichrichrichrichrichrichrichrichrichrichrichrichrichrichrichrichrichrichrichrichrichrichrichrichrichrichrichrichrichrichrichrichrichrichrichrichrichrichrichrichrichrichrichrichrichrichrichrichr
so you copy this come here and paste it here so that should be you see the form it's xx dash five time x dash x so it should be something like this five time x time so it should be ua sorry you can take the whole thing then even if you put the um, just the numbers without the ua it works but let's just be safe right all the other things the nitty gritty details you can come and have a look later on but um if you have a Google AdSense, you place it here so that you can track um, the AdSense as well. Right? It's enabled. Click on Save Changes. And um, technically, that should work. So if we go back here and then we go on Google we say save and finish what will happen is Google will check if this plugin is currently installed on rich Rajiv um, you won't see anything on the site right now obviously this is in the back end so you won't see any codes that has been installed it's uh, somewhere in in the codes in within the codes and um, you won't see this Rich Rajiv Kistu site today. I, I mean, you will see it, but it won't be installed yet because Google takes some times before, some time before it displays. You see, at the moment, you see um, this sign means it hasn't been verified. Here, you see resistance band training, and there's a tick here. It means that it is all up and working, and the code has been detected by Google. Okay, well, this is it for now. Um, if you have any questions, please don't uh, hesitate to write me an email on rajivkistu at gmail.com or Skype me rajiv.kistu. Enjoy the videos. Take care and bye for now.